I don't think that without AWS's expertise and reliability, we would have been able to get to where we have gotten for our customers. Their performance has been incredible and, and their reliability has been unparalleled in, in this space. My name is Stefan Zier, I'm the Chief Architect at Sumo Logic and I'm responsible for the overall system architecture on top of AWS. Sumo Logic is an enterprise log analytics service that solves three valuable use cases for customers. Customers use it to do application troubleshooting and analytics, as well as security use cases, as well as business intelligence type questions on top of their log data. Sumo Logic runs their entire platform on AWS. When we started out, we were basically a bunch of enterprise software guys that didn't know much about data centers. So we saw AWS and basically jumped on it and said, hey, this is, this is enabling us to build this product in the cloud and, and offer a great service to our customers. Since we built our system from the get-go for AWS, we've architected it in an N plus one fashion. So our entire system is made up of services that run in clusters, and the clusters are N plus one instances. So we always have what we need in terms of capacity and some extra capacity provision. We use a pretty good mix of AWS instance types. We use M1s for historical reasons, but increasingly we're switching to the M3s and C3s because they offer a lot better price per performance ratio, and the SSDs for, for anything that involves I.O. are just killer performance-wise for the bigger clusters where we're price sensitive because these newer instance types offer a lot more bang for the buck, they offer a lot more performance for your dollar basically. And so where, where that matters to us, we've switched to these newer instance types. Along our ingest path, we have a variety of different workloads that have different needs. There's some clusters like the continuous query cluster that's purely CPU intensive. So we pick high CPU instances for those use cases, whereas there's other clusters like the index cluster that takes customer data and indexes them that requires a lot of both CPU and I.O. performance. So when we switched to C3 instances for our indexing cluster, we saw about a 4x improvement in performance, which meant we were basically able to scale down the size of the cluster to a quarter of its previous size and pay a quarter of the money we were paying previously and those are benefits we're able to hand down to our customers in terms of cost savings. Speed is one of the biggest benefits of AWS for us. We can react to new requirements very quickly because we can take ready-made, well-proven services off the shelf and build on top of them. We have been able to very quickly grow the system as new customers come online, bring new data into the system. Uh, there's no lead times for provisioning. There's no lead times if we decide we want a different flavor of hardware. Uh, it's all just an API call away, so we can very quickly um, progress our system and, and advance our architecture uh, on top of AWS. It's been really amazing that AWS offers a large catalog of instance types for our use. We, we can really pick the right one for the workload and we can change it out later as we understand the workload better actually for a given cluster. They've been better than all the competitors in terms of progressing services, coming up with new services, um, evolving their pricing, evolving their performance. It's, it's been a really, really good platform to be on.